Hi and welcome to The Dapper Man, my name is Greg. Today we're going to be talking about week 41 of my year-long beard journey, welcoming new subscribers, answering questions and comments, and talking about what's coming up for The Dapper Man, so stay tuned. Hi, welcome back. So as I said earlier, we're going to be talking about week 41 of my year-long beard. Uh, I've been growing this beard for well, so since early September. It is now 41 weeks later, and I think it's actually turned out pretty well. So let's take a quick look at it. As you can see, the beard is very full, very, very frizzy. Uh, in the bright sunlight, you can still see a lot of the red in the beard. And of course, you can still see the gray, which I think just adds character. The mustache is the weak point. Unfortunately, uh, it's long enough that I, it's a problem eating, but it's not thick enough for me to handle bar. So I have to use something like a mustache wax or mustache mud when I eat to keep the, uh, my mustache out of my food, and so I just don't bite my mustache. The only issue with this week uh, was that I left my, I lost my comb, my Kent comb. Uh, I went to visit family in Albuquerque, and at one point I took my comb out to uh, brush my mustache, and uh, I left it uh, out on the table. Uh, so I will have to order a new comb. If you haven't had a Kent comb or haven't tried a Kent comb, they are fantastic combs. They're actually handmade in Kent, England. Uh, they're really high quality. They're a little more expensive, but they're really worth the money. Because the teeth on the comb uh, are hand cut and polished, uh, you don't have a lot of burrs in them, you don't have a lot of defects, so they just glide through the beard and the mustache really, really smoothly. I'll go ahead and put a link below, uh, but I think you'll really like the king comb, so give them a shot. Alright, let's go ahead and welcome some new subscribers to, uh, to the Dapper Man. We have Brent. Blaine and Clayton. I want to thank you and welcome to the Dapper Man. I hope you really enjoy the content that we have. If you would like us to cover anything specifically, feel free to reach out to us and we'll go ahead and work that into our rotation. So thanks for joining. Also want to mention that uh, we're getting closer to our 100 user giveaway. As I've stated before, once we reach 100 subscribers on uh, YouTube, I will be doing a giveaway. Uh, what that'll include is probably some of my beard products and probably a cigar or two. So help us reach 100 subscribers, go ahead and tell your family, your friends, anybody that has a beard or anybody that you think might like this channel, get them to, get them to subscribe and uh, once we hit 100 subscribers, like I said, we'll do a giveaway. Alright, let's answer some questions and some comments. So uh, no questions this week actually, but I do want to thank uh, Make My Day 44 Mag for his comment on the Perdomo uh, cigar review. That was a great cigar to smoke. I really, really enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun pairing it with the uh, Guinness Blonde, and uh, it was just a lot of fun hanging out with Matt. If you, uh, if anybody has a specific cigar you would like me to uh, review, uh, or even a whiskey or a beer you want me to review, uh, go ahead and just uh, tell me in the comments. I'll go ahead and get that into my uh, schedule. The other comment is from Oki Piper John. Uh, just telling me to let my beard grow and uh, let it go full wizard. Um, that is definitely in the running right now. I, I with a couple modifications. I do want to trim my mustache, obviously. Uh, get you know get that under control, and I'll probably just clean up some of the lines along the cheeks and along the neckline. But other than that, I'm really really tempted just to continue to let it grow and uh, see how it goes. If I can't make up my mind on exactly what style I want, that's exactly what I want to do. I'll just go ahead and trim my mustache, clean it up a little bit, and then just continue to let it grow. So what's next for the Dapper Man? So a couple things. The uh, Boss Man Beard Product Review. I know I've been promising that for a couple weeks now. Uh, that is done. That is scheduled to be uploaded here on Thursday. So that'll be the next video that uh, comes up after this one. So I hope you uh, like that video. It, the products are really good. And uh, just watch that video for more information. Other things coming up are the uh, Gentleman Kit or the Gentleman's Box Review. Uh, I ordered a gentleman, what's called a Gentleman's Box. It's one of those monthly subscription boxes. Uh, I saw it on Facebook. I subscribed to it. I got my first box the other day. I opened it. I did a video about it. 
Uh, that'll also be posting in about a week, uh, a week after the Boss Man product. So stay tuned for that. I also got my Allen Edmonds, the ones I sent for recrafting. I got those back. They look fantastic. I will go ahead and do a video about the recrafting process, my thoughts on the rec uh, getting shoes recrafted, and I'll do that side by side comparison with the brand new Allen Edmonds, the seconds, and then the factory, uh, sorry, the re the used which have been recrafted. Lastly, uh, I mentioned last week that the Dapper Man actually has his own products now, or we have our own products. Uh, we have a beard oil, beard balm, and beard wax. I am getting the website set up to uh, be able to sell those directly to you. Um, we'll also sell them on Facebook and Etsy and eBay most likely. So stay tuned. Uh, once we actually get that set up, I will actually send out links to everybody so they can go ahead and uh, purchase our uh, beard oils and products. Well, that's it for now. I hope you have a fantastic day wherever you are. We always appreciate comments and questions, so please uh, feel free to reach out to us. Uh, you can follow us on... Oh, well, everything goes to the website first, I should say, the dapperman.org. Uh, once it's there, then it goes out to Facebook and Twitter and Pinterest and Instagram. So if you want to follow us, go to uh, the dapperman.org. Make sure you subscribe there to our newsletter uh, or our email alerts because any, anytime we post something, it'll go out to uh, the email list first and then go to Facebook and everywhere else. But on Facebook and t Twitter, Pinterest, Instagram, you can find us at the Dapper Man US. So I hope you, uh, I hope you follow us. And again, we'll help us reach 100, 100 subscribers and we'll go ahead and do that giveaway. Well, that's all for now. Again, have a fantastic day wherever you are and we'll talk to you soon. Bye.